Hey guys, Lacey here. Today is another episode of You Guessed It, Pretty Prepper. So, you guys want to come along and check out what I have for you today in my Pretty Prepper box here? Boom. Something cool, something fun, something everybody needs and everybody wants. So, that being said, let's open it up and let's see what's inside. Mr. Lacey has been shopping again and he said, baby, baby, you got to do this, you got to do this. And I'm said, okay, what is it, what is it? So he gets me this pretty little box with a pretty little surprise inside um, for a prepper time because, you know, hurricane season is upon us and everybody needs, I guess, one of these um, for hurricane season. <laughs> or not, or just for fun if you want to run around, you know, the house and just be silly. Um, Halloween is coming. You could also use it for that if you so choose. So what we have in this here box of pretty prepper stuff is a Russian GP5 gas mask. Yes, you heard it correctly. It is a Russian GP5 gas mask. Paper. Nobody needs that. Ready guys? Ta -da! There it is. In all of its Russian GP5 gas mask glory. Yes, it is a Russian GP5 gas mask. And we are going to open it up, pull it out, and check out all of its pretty little toys that come along with it. So, little information about it is the Russian GP5 gas mask intended for the Cold War civilian um, use and help to protect their face eyes and respiratory system against chemicals and radioactive and biological warfare against agents I'm sorry agents in the form of gas vapors aerosols and more it's the more that's always questionable um, it's lightweight shower cap design um, gives you full face and head coverage and the dual eye openings have sealed protective eye lenses comes with an unused soviet i'm sorry an unused screw on soviet 40 millimeter can filter cartridge and carrying bag it has its own bag isn't that nice because you know every gas mask <laughs> needs its own bag so that being said let's pull all this stuff out there it is it's as sketchy as I'll get out, and I'm not gonna lie. I think nightmares are made of this kind of stuff. So, there's the screw on thing for the filter. Let's pull that out. I don't know if I'm gonna really get that over my head. And for all you guys, here's the bag. So, if you're wondering where that was, there's the bag that it comes in, or that you could store it in, rather. Trying to find the opening. Ah, there we go. There's the opening for the bag. Boom. And then here is the screw on canister. Ta -da! This is sealed, so I'm not going to open this to attach it, but you get the gist. You pull off the little tab, you screw it onto the little hole. We have it. Thank you, ma'am. You got a canister and a filter. So, um, let me see. I really don't want to pull all my hair out. Let's do this. So let's do it. Let's do it swim style. So <laughs> look, I don't know if this is gonna fit. This looks like something weird when you do it like this. So there you go, guys. The Russian GP5 gas mask. Oh, it's not funny. <laughs> But it does seal very tightly. So I don't think you have anything to worry about as far as that goes. But once you screw that little canister on, you should be good to go. Protect it from any and all biological and gas vapors or such, whatever. So, with that being said, you guys have a good weekend, a good afternoon, a good whatever. Yeah. <laughs> that was you guys next time. Remember, if you like this video, hit like and subscribe down at the bottom. I need subscribers, people. Help me out. Send this to a friend. Tell them to subscribe. Tell them to turn off the notifications. I don't care. Just get me some subscribers. Again, you guys have a good weekend. I'll see you next time. Me and my crazy mask. Halloween is coming up. I'm going to be scaring the little kitties as they come around. You guys have a good one. Bye.